guys, welcome or welcome back to our channel. If you are new here, my name is Aletha Bell and I am a homeschooling mom to two beautiful children. And it's officially autumn, yay! That's my favorite season, so I tried to be, uh, to look like falsy right here. Look at my colors. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, that, that temperature are cooler and the days are shorter. Anyways, the reason why I am here today is I'll be sharing with you guys or I will talk about our spelling curriculum. So we use the grammar of spelling from Logos Press and this is the book. What good about this is everything is in one book. So there's only one book. The first half is the teacher's manual and then the second half is the student's workbook so yay it's very handy everything is in one book that's cool right anyways my purpose of this video is to encourage other homeschoolers or future homeschoolers i hope this will give you ideas or idea if you are there browsing and looking for spelling curriculum i got you covered so this is how it looks the grammar of spelling grade 2 so what i love about this this is their introduction the grammar of spelling the art of reading and writing english the knowledge of letters is one of the greatest blessings that ever god bestowed on the children of men by this means we preserve for our own use through all our lives but our memory would have lost in a few days and lay up rich treasure of knowledge for those that shall come after us i also love this part here thus letters give us a sort of immortality in this world and they are given us in the word of god to support our immortal hopes in the next those therefore who willfully neglect this sort of knowledge and despise the art of letters need no heavier course of punishment than what they choose for themselves to live and die in ignorance both of the things of God and man. I love that part. Children in the grammar stage love knowledge and facts. They are fascinated by words and they can memorize easily. Spelling correctly is a tool we want to give the students that will help them with written communication. Spelling is a discipline. Oh, I love that. That's very, that's a very strong sentence. Spelling is a discipline. It is hard work, which is true. This is the table of contents, the grammar of spelling. So yeah, this week we are on lesson five. Initial blend, CCVC and CCCVC words or consonant, consonant, vowel, consonant and consonant, 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 vowel, consonant. So one lesson will take us two weeks to finish. Oopsie, yeah. Uh, we only do spelling twice a week, uh, every Mondays and Wednesdays. And then on the first day... It's our preview time. Uh, I will introduce these new spelling words to him and then discuss their meanings. And he will work one third of the worksheet. This is the worksheet, the first part of it. Uh, it is broken down into three. So on the first day, I will let him do this. And then. There's a note here in the left column. He will mark the short vowels with a brief. And then in the right column, he will circle the beginning words, just like what he did here. Then on the second day, it's dictation day. So I will dictate these sentences to him and then I will go over it. Check if he misspelled any words and if he does, he will write them correctly. Cumulative spelling lists and dictation are the heart of this spelling program. Dictation helps the students hear and write sentences. It also 
reinforces listening and following direction skills. So these are the sentences that I dictated. So I have to check if he capitalized the first letter of the sentence. I will check the end marks. Yeah. And then after that, he will work this part of the worksheet. And then on the third day, he will finish this remaining part of the worksheet. And then there's also another page that he needs to do, uh, flip and write. It's on the back of this page. I will show you. This one, flip and write. So these are the words on the other side. And he needs to write them in capital letters. I love what they did here. I love this idea. Flip and write. Uh, my son will look carefully at the word on the front of the sheet. Keep the spelling in his mind. Flip the paper over and write the word in print or cursive on, on this column. So here are lowercase letters and here are uppercase letters. This will provide an opportunity to see the words in a different format than usual, requiring more care and checking to ensure that the words are indeed spelled correctly. I love how Logos Press uh, did this. And then these words here, he, have, he has to write them twice here. And then on the fourth day, we will do the spelling test. Before we will do the test, we will review some words first. So there are 20 words to be spelled. I will dictate those. And then there are two sentences. And also, the name is three points. Yeah. So this is his test. Three points, the date. So... He got one wrong swim. This was an end. And then if he did wrong, I will let him rewrite it. So this is just for us. I will grade them. The sentences, I will check the capitalization. First letter of the sentence should be capitalized. And then I will check the right punctuations or end marks. Yeah, so that's how we do uh, the Logos Press, uh, the grammar of spelling. So yeah, that is basically how we do uh, spelling in this household. And yeah, it's just very easy. And, uh, and again, thank you so much for being with us. And please don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe and click that no notification bell so that every time we put new videos, you will be notified. And they always want to be <laughs> involved in this vlogging. <laughs> okay. And clean poo. Bye. Always remember that you are doing great. God bless. Bye. Bye.